What is going on, everyone? Commodore Lassie today, bringing to you guys my live reaction to Jujutsu Kaisen episode 13. Now, the episode has come out, but before we even get into it, I just want to say Merry Christmas, everybody, and Happy Holidays to those who don't celebrate Christmas. Special time of the year. We were a family, our friends, and all that. I took a little bit of time out of my day, though, because I want to be able to watch Kaisen, but after that, I went back to the festivities. And uh, it's been a great time, man. Honestly, just being able to enjoy it. Um, some time finally with family, especially away from work and all that, since now I'm on vacation. <sighs> we got some great stuff. We got some merch. We got some merch. Oh, shout out to the family, man. They got me this. I was just like, look, I'm like, yo, man, repping the channel. You can love to see it. But <sighs> we got to get into this episode. Based on the title, I have to assume that they're going to be adapting up to the end of this arc. And then after that, we're supposed to be on a two week break, I believe, until January 15th. So. After that, we dive into the second core. So this will be the last time we get the current openings and endings. So we got to enjoy it. We got to love it. Because it'll be the last time before we move on. So Crunchyroll is a place to go to if you want to watch the episodes alongside with me. Get your players ready. Because ladies and gentlemen, we are getting started in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stato. Okay, two, three, beautiful. Ooh, the little screen right here. Oh, oh man. So they're repeating what we saw from last week, but from a different angle instead. Okay. Look at his face, though. <laughs> oh my god. Bro, Mahito has that true psycho face. No one does it better. At least for like the new gen. This OST right now is nice. Yeah, see, this actually feels like how in the manga when, when, we, when I first saw it. Hard right now, okay. The seven three sorcerer. Okay, okay, let's go. Straight into it. Man turned to Sonic the Hedgehog, the porcupines, all that. Did not land a hit. Thought this would be a good one. But they just dodge it. Look at that. Oh, man. Yeah, he turns to his little form and stuff. It's like a troll, I swear to god. It's like a little troll version though from Mahito when it goes into this form. I need to make him behave for a bit. So disgusting when he does that. Jesus. He can't kill humans. Uh, playing with his weakness. Because remember, he att he attests this kind of stuff. He doesn't want to do that. Look at look at that. It's like a child, man. You think he wants to do that to them? Oh my god. My boy suffered way too much. He suffered way too much. You're wrong. You're in the middle of making that ring calculation. For up to me. I say you're the fool. And we go, uh, Yeah. There we go. 
Here we go. Bam, let's go. Look at them strikes. The the chain like the winter soldier. You know that one scene that like, like imp attack after attack. Look at that, yo! <laughs> it is so we gonna weigh on him. Is this It's time. It's time. It's time. Yo. Look at him. Gang signs. Domain expansion. Look at that, bro. Oh my god. Nah, this is beautiful. Self embodiment of perfection. Nah, this is just. This might be better than how the manga did it. Look at it, dude! Right now, I'm just. Grateful to you. Straight into the opening. Lord Almighty. That is a crazy way. To just go five minutes in before you start the opening. Like. Just exactly how I hope it would go. That was really well done, man. I don't know. MAPPA has been on something else when it comes to this anime adaptation. You know, of all the works that they've done, to, for me at least, it's got to be the best one. You know? Like, I have to really look back on like their whole... like. Um... I mean, Ushi no Tora, I know it definitely it was a really good one as well from them, but... This one, though, no, this is, like, different. Far, far different beast. Uh, but, but the way they're going with the pacing, it had, like, there's no way they're going to cut off on some cliffhanger stuff and then make me wait two weeks to see the end, so not. Nah. I love how they add, like, the stuff in with uh, Mahito's um, domain expansion there. I need a wallpaper of that, bro. Like, of this and that shot, too. With Junpei and, uh, and Yuji. Yeah, I've seen this, too, by the way, with the, on, on Twitter with Yuji with the tears and stuff. That hit so hard when I woke up that morning and saw it, like... Why did only steal none of them inside? Yeah, for sure, the uh, pace is going to wrap up. This music. I need to find out who the composer is again because they're absolutely insane. With some of the tracks I've been playing so far, it's so good. Literally in the palm of his hand now. Yeah, I love the way they just did that shot too. Shit. They have to be prepared to cast away their lives for others. And to occasionally force their comrades to do so. Oh, this is like a Resident Evil OST, by the way. He played the game. Here we go. Here we go. Look at business suits, not of me, like.
Be scared of the virgin. <laughs> the man's English is killing me right now. Yeah, you see, like, basically what his life has become now. Literally, all it is is doing just the work. He has to make enough money so that afterwards he can be able to live his life as normally as possible, you know. There's no, like, aspirations, no dream, no real goal or anything for him. It's just, just to get by. He's, he's the one saying it, but he's the one feeling it, really. Not just her. make those people even more wealthy. No one would mind if I was gone. It's even more, especially looking back, but It was shot, literally. <laughs> like, bleh. if anything still feels off, please go to the hospital. This OST right now I'm playing. Oh man, being a manga reader it hurts. It hurts. Hey, call love that bad. Call love that bad. Why are you laughing? <laughs> Need your gratitude. I've already received it from lots of others. I have no regrets. Oh, that was just done really well. That was done really well. And now is time. Let's go, my boy. Put this man in a blender. More residents sitting inside the barriers. The weak here is attack from outside. These visual shots are so gorgeous. Which can't do victory. Once they're ensnared their target, there's even more true. That's even more true. Bro, these shots. There lies something that does not be time. See yo! I warned you. Look at this! No, there wouldn't be a second time. <laughs> oh. He lives guided by only his pleasure and displeasure. Whether you die or you die, doesn't matter. Bro, I love how he has Big Bird's voice. I truly don't care. My God. Nah, who, this composer needs a pay raise. This composer needs a pay raise. 
This OST is God tier, man. It just fits the entire mood of what's going on here. Uh, now you know fear, buddy. Now you know fear. Now you know what it means to be afraid. The guitar rift. Man. Yeah, he's not even realizing what's going on, too. Right away. Go. Yep, the man is going to turn into second form Cell <laughs> from the Cell games with the explosion. Only way you're going to try and get out of that. Bruh, let's go! Divergent Fist! Boom! Let's go. It only got him like a balloon. <sighs> Man. And they thought they had him right there and this dude just escapes. And he just drops. You gotta remember, look at all the injuries he suffered from prior. Yeah. His mind is telling him to keep going, but his body is saying, no, nah, I can't. Yep. Down for the count, just like that. Can't be blamed, man. When you get stabbed like that, you could be crazy if you keep on going. But you can tell, look at my head. It's like an ass whipping. So that was the King Curses real Mr. Curse. Now these shots are beautiful here. Holy that presence. The age of curses will come. I can kill his soul over and over again. How should I kill it next time? And you know what he means in a literal sense because of what he did to jump his soul. With all the bodies. So he took over himself. Yeah. Well, he let him in. I killed a person today. understand anymore. What is a proper death? You'll still do it anyway.
You're a jujitsu sorcerer now, he's a Tori Kun, yo. Oh man, uh, the end of this arc is so painful. Yep, people who just stood by and watched and did nothing about it. And now you're seeing like how they're feeling about it. Because they're not being filled with regrets. Yeah, move away. I mean, that's what you kind of deserve after what you did to him, bullying him and all that. So, you're lucky that's all you got. I'll have to bear the crime of killing Yoshino's heart for the rest of our lives. Yeah. This song, dude. I always have a proper death to so at least. Until I do understand. Until I kill him. I won't. Lose again. That's my boy. Ah, oh, the determination. Because he realizes after everything that happened, the things that he wanted to avoid from happening, it happened. But now it makes him more determined to make sure he goes out and accomplishes what he wants to do. He wants to understand what it means to have a proper death by being surrounded by people he cares about to accomplish the task at hand. And for the first time, seeing like what would happen... When things didn't go as they planned and they backfired, he realized just how important this is, this thing was for him. At the start of it, it, it was understand the proper death, all that. But now, even more so, he wants to make sure that job is done. So until that man, Mahito, is in the grave by Yuji's hands, like he is put in the grave. My guy throws the dirt on the grave. It's not done. Not done by a long shot. So one of my favorite chapters early on in the series too. With that last uh, ten minutes, like one of my favorites, because it goes and just shows why how much I love this character because of how how he had to go through its, his own form of suffering on the road to what he wants to accomplish, and then the determination just skyrockets from there. He says, "Yeah, I, I need to do this. There's gonna be some tough days, but there'll always be a light at the end of the tunnel." I need this juju stroll to hit right now to save my soul. Yo, hot pot? Damn, for looking good though. Meatballs are great. I made them. I believe it. He washed his hands, didn't he? Spoons? Oh, me, yeah, if you want to get the thing, yeah. Oh, damn, well, I got myself a little recipe now I can cook up. A little difference. <laughs> He's going to want more than one. He taught me how to make these. Um, and, uh, I hate this damn anime. Because of their heads. Ugh. I hate that, but he's a Dory's legacy. It's a reason to make. He wish you go can make them. I taught them all. I can't wait to see these two again. Oh my god. Wow, this anime is, is, is gas. Ah! Uh...
the arc. Episode 14, Kyoto Sister School Exchange Event, Group Battle Zero. Man! Ah, it's going to be a tough, tough wait until January 15 when we start the second core. But honestly, man, at least because we know the running joke with MAPPA and stuff because they're literally adapting anime from now on. But at least hopefully the staff and stuff will get some time to you know relax, get a breather in and stuff. If they're not already by the time the episode came out. And then we go in, man. But yo, first core of season one complete. Greatness, man. Small fry, small fry, reverse retribution, or the versus Mahito arc has been completed. Great stuff. This was the arc, as I say, that really got me to say, okay, I'm here for the long run when it comes to Kaisen. From first chapter to following the little news here and there and stuff for it, when it wasn't getting adapted with chapters and stuff and it wasn't being translated. And then by the time this arc began, it was like chapter four. So a little bit, a little bit like uh, early into this arc that we're going to get into the second core is when the, you know, this started translating every single week after that point. But by, before that, it was literally, by the time I got to here, I was like, okay, man, I, I, I'm, I'm with it. Like, I want to see how this is all going to shape up by the end. So when you look at like the first like 30 some chapters in the sense here, the first 13 episodes for Kaisen. I think it's more than enough to kind of get an idea of, you know, where you stand with the series. If you want to be a part of its long-term future to see, like, you know, what it's going to become and evolve into. And to see what it is right now, you know, without speaking on the manga. But also in terms of the sales, the popularity of the series has grown. So, as a day one fan, it's just been beautiful to see, you know, the rise of the series. From the unknown to, honestly, one of the... The pillars right now of the current jump era like of this current lineup of series we got a weekly shonen jump it's already up there among the top ones you know so i'm happy for it but that second core is gonna be so gas but now first core was amazing you know i know episode seven i think technically would be the highlight of the season because of the way you know gojo the main expansion the void itself man it's just like <sighs> was immaculate but this entire first core so far has been absolutely brilliant and i have no worries no concerns because the second core is gonna be crazy second core is gonna be crazy so to be able to relive all this again you know as a manga reader i can't wait i truly can't wait and i really love that jujutsu stroll at the end afterwards too you know, because that obviously, of course, you know, extra stuff that they added in there, but really to emphasize on the fact that because, you know, they're still dealing with the fact that they believe Yuji is out the pains that he had died. Um, going back to the curse room mark and stuff, but if I speak any more on that, I'll be in big trouble. But great episode, great way to end versus Mahito's arc in the anime. But let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below in regards to the episode. And let me know how you feel on episodes 1 through 13 as the anime only. How are you guys feeling with the anime so far? If you guys are enjoying it. If you feel like you still need more time with it to kind of get a real grasp of it. And if, you know, just let me know your thoughts on all of that. Manga readers, how are you feeling with this anime adaptation so far? What has been the best part, honestly, for you when it comes to anime adaptation? And of course... Are you excited for what's to come in core two? Because when we get that, I'm just telling you right now, if you weren't excited already off these first 13 episodes, normal people, you know what, you would have probably left by now. But I promise you right now, it's going to be some great stuff coming up as you get ready for the second half of the anime. And I know for a fact that hopefully this is going to go and help the rise of Akatami Gage's upcoming masterpiece. Ah, the way it's going to be tough. The wait is going to be tough, but I will catch you guys on the Sunday afterwards, of course, from the manga. I believe a week from now afterwards because we're on break, technically still with the holidays and all that. But like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new here. If you want to be part of the weekly experience when it comes to my coverage of Jujutsu Kaisen week in, week out. Fridays with the anime, Sunday with the manga. If you haven't subscribed already, subscribe if you haven't. Click on the bell of Shandora so that everything that goes on the channel. With that being said, I will catch you guys in two weeks' time for the anime. One week's time for the manga. As we continue to go ahead, give our thanks, be happy that Gege series is on the rise to prominence. And of course, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy New Year to everybody.
Hopefully, 2021 is going to be a way better year than it was 2020. I know we had some good stuff, but a lot of bad stuff, obviously. But hopefully, 2021 will be a lot better for everybody. You know, life, anime, everything, man. It's all we can ask for. But until then, until then before my brain just goes crazy, I'm out of here, guys. Commodore Les signing off. Thanks so much for watching. As always, take care. Going crazy.